I left my keys and phone in the house. Welcome back to the channel guys. My name is Eric and today we're going to be talking about the interior camera that some of you may not even know is there. Okay, so if you look inside the car above the rear view mirror, you will see a camera. Why is there a camera inside your Tesla? So if you look inside the Tesla manual, it will tell you that yes there is a camera in the interior of the car and it's currently not turned on they have it there basically for some future use that they have yet to explain to us so the internet has a lot of information out there and just some of the talking points about this camera is in regards to another level of autonomy when you're doing the full self-driving or even autopilot if it notices the driver is falling asleep or turning around looking in the back and just not paying attention it might give you an alert or it may even shut down autopilot if it notices that you're asleep another example of what it could be used for is when Elon decides to turn all our cars into robo taxis and we're sending our cars out to make money for us and it's picking up strangers and you never know what strangers are going to do in your car so it's to monitor those passengers that are inside the car um, also even if you become a rideshare driver, uh, you could be driving the car, but it's for your own protection having a camera here monitoring the people behind you. These are all just a couple of examples of what it could be used for. But the question that I want answered that a lot of you conspiracy theorists may agree upon is, is Tesla watching us? So do I think that Tesla is watching us? I'll put it this way, as a company, I think they're not watching us. But is the capability for some rogue agent at Tesla to remote into our car and watch us? I think that is possible. Just look at these hackers online that can take over laptops and turn on the webcams and watch you while you're doing whatever you're doing at your house. It is something that does happen, it can happen, and there's a way to protect yourself as well. So like I said, this issue has been around for a while with webcams on our laptops. Uh, but now that it's come to our automobiles, there's something you can use to block them from seeing you. I'm talking about a little block for the camera that just sticks on and it uh, will open and shut whenever you choose for it to be open. So I'm going to go ahead and install this now and we'll test it out here. So this is it and it just has double-sided tape on the back side that way it is easily removable if you decide to do away with this in the future but for now um, let's just install this. Okay so I'm just lining this up around where the camera goes following the line of the, the bottom of where the camera is and now I just push down and here it is installed as you can see it actually looks like it's made with the car and there's a little door that you can close to turn it off and that way you have your privacy and in the future whenever it becomes actually useful for something you just open it back up and it's there so there it is that's all there is to it pretty easy to install and no more worries about being watched by the man so if you think this is uh, useful let me know by hitting that like button if you want to buy one of these for yourself, I'll put a link in the description below where you can pick one up. I ordered it. It came from China, so it took a couple weeks to get here, but 
I ordered a couple other things that came with it, so I'll show you that stuff later. But let me know if you found this video helpful at all. Are you a conspiracy theorist like myself? Are you paranoid? Or do you think I'm crazy? Let me know in the comments below. If you want to see more crazy videos like this, hit the subscribe button. Take care, guys. Not afraid, no, not afraid.